Hello, my little angels. Does it feel like summer weather already? We've had some hot days, haven't we? What do you like to do when it's hot out? Many people, see now this is where I wish you were here to help me, but I know many people like boating, like tubing and skiing and fishing and kayaking and swimming. But what is important to have before you do those things? You know, it's called a flotation device. Like this, a life jacket. They're very, very important for even good swimmers in case you have an accident. A flotation device like a life jacket can save your life. I heard a story about some people who went fishing on a big lake. Before they left, everyone got their life jackets, put them on, and they were ready to go and have fun. But one man did not want to wear his life jacket. Well, after they went out on that big lake, there was a storm and the wind blew and the waves came up into the boat. And that, they became so high that it turned their boat over. And the people who were wearing life jackets made it to shore and were saved. But the man who did not want to wear his life jacket drowned. The man could have been saved if he would have worn his life jacket, right? Are you wondering what this has to do with our Bible story? Well, the Bible tells us God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Most people know that verse by heart, maybe as much as saying the Lord's Prayer. So the man that drowned, if he believed in Jesus, he's in heaven with God and Jesus. Jesus is our life jacket. God sent him to earth to save us through his death and resurrection, we can be forgiven of our sins and have eternal life with God. We will always face storms in our life, but when we do, we will have our life jacket, Jesus. So Miss Nancy says, wear your life jacket on the water and remember Jesus is with us every day. Let us pray. Dear God, we know you sent Jesus to die on the cross to save us. We pray everyone will take hold of the one thing that can save us, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let us pray the Lord's Prayer together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Have a safe Memorial Day weekend. Have fun.